Bose management, heel work. The heel is another term for the number four or drop off firefighter. Moving hose and backing up the nozzle is their first priority. The heel has a few options when moving hose into a building. One is simply pulling hose from a stationary position, hand over hand in a straight line. This works well if there's limited obstructions or turns to navigate. As the nozzle firefighter reaches a turn, they need to communicate back to the heel what their needs are. Once this communication has been made, the heel can bump up to a corner and continue moving hose and keep it off of the friction points. Taking a bite. Here the heel brings a bite of hose with him to the first friction point. He stays to the outside corner and uses the bus driver technique to feed hose to his partner. It's everyone's job on the fire ground to keep kinks out of the line, especially the heels. Good job here. Here's another example of the bite method. The heel has flipped the line back on top of itself and stays close to the nozzle as they move down the span. He drops the bite about mid-span and continues with the nozzle as they make a push into the next room. A couple shots of what is called straight sticking. The heel is keeping this, a straight line of hose behind the nozzle and keeping it low to the ground. And here we're going to see a hit and move from a clamp position. Firefighter is going to flow water, communicate to his partner that they're moving. Notice the heel is keeping that hose low. Nozzle person here is switching in from a clamp to a hip grip and he's going to call for his partner to bump up and they're going to perform a push. A push is what we do when, when we flow and move at the same time. We're flowing water, moving down a space. Again we see a hit and move, this time from a hip grip position. The heel straight sticks the line, keeping it low and allowing it to feed directly into the hip of the nozzle. Good communication and regular practice are vital to effective hose work. Good. The heel in this clip is feeding line to his partner from the point of entry. He then takes advantage of the T hallway and loads it with some surplus hose. This is called loading the T or overshooting. Here's another quick example. As the heel, you are the motor. The focus should be on pushing hose to the nozzle. This allows the nozzle firefighter to focus on flowing water and killing the fire. The body mechanics we use as the heel firefighter are specific. We move hose with our legs where the majority of our strength is. The rear leg is up and the lead leg is down. The rear hand utilizes an underhand grip and stays locked into the hose. The lead hand is on the ground, stabilizing the body in a tripod position. Triangles are strong. Learning and using good technique allows us to be more effective firefighters, experience less fatigue, and to stay in the fight longer. Ready? Yep.